Understanding the phrase, stay hungry, a guide to English idioms. Hello everyone, today, we're diving into the fascinating world of English idioms. Specifically, we'll explore the meaning and use of the phrase, stay hungry. This idiom might sound straightforward, but it's packed with deeper meaning and significance, especially in motivational contexts. So, let's unravel its mysteries together. Stay hungry is an idiomatic expression that encourages a continual pursuit of goals, ambitions, or knowledge. It doesn't refer to physical hunger, but rather a metaphorical hunger for success or achievement. This phrase is often used to inspire people to never become complacent or satisfied with their current achievements, but to always strive for more. While the exact origin of, stay hungry, is unclear, it has been popularized in various speeches and writings, especially in the realm of self-improvement and entrepreneurship. The phrase gained significant attention when used by Steve Jobs, co-founder of Apple Inc., in his famous Stanford commencement speech, urging graduates to, stay hungry, stay foolish. This context highlighted the importance of maintaining ambition and a willingness to take risks. To better understand how to use, stay hungry, let's look at some examples. Even after achieving her first milestone, she continued to stay hungry for more success. The coach always tells his team to stay hungry for victory, no matter how many games they win. There are several other idiomatic expressions with similar meanings. For instance, keep your eye on the prize emphasizes focusing on your ultimate goal. Never rest on your laurels advises against becoming too comfortable with past achievements. And that's a wrap on stay hungry. I hope this video has been enlightening and helps you understand not just the meaning but also the motivational spirit behind this idiom. Remember, staying hungry for knowledge and growth can lead to incredible achievements. Until next time, keep exploring and enjoying the richness of the English language.